The all share price index reached at an all time high of 9,079 points today, closing at 8,931 points, while the SP SL index closed at 3,355 points. The enthusiastic local appetite on logistics, exports, and other dollar earning stocks drove the market to reach its new highs. The weekly average turnover amounted to rupees 11 billion and the average volume for the week was 408 million shares. The ASPI witnessed an 8% increase and the S&P SL witnessed a 17% increase within the week. High local interest was witnessed due to several reasons. June quarter, usually being a slower quarter compared to the rest of the other quarters, CSE witnessed its best reported corporate earnings for a June quarter. News on Sri Lanka receiving the IMF SDR worth Rs. 800 million, talk about Sri Lanka moving to the IMF program, furthermore, prevailing lower interest rates too assisted in the high turnovers. The top traded counters for the week were Expo Lanka Holdings, Browns Investments, Haley's, LOLC Holdings, and LOLC Finance. Further, off-board transactions were witnessed in Hatton National Bank, Sanasi Development Bank, Commercial Leasing and Finance, Lanka Tiles, John Kears Holdings, and Cargill Salon. Highlights of the week. Dilma Salon Tea announced a final dividend of Rs. 18. Elipitia Plantations announced a dividend of Rs. 2. Eight Consents Plantation announced a dividend of Rs. 8. Harris Trander Mills announced a dividend of Rs. 30. Meanwhile, LOLC acquired a 15% stake in Sanazi Development Bank through a secondary public offering. This is Sonla Dasanayaka from SoftLogic Stock Brokers. Thank you for tuning in today and see you next week.